This example problem gives us a little practice using the Lorentz transformation equations. We imagine in this problem that there are two frames, S and S prime, such that S prime is moving along the x-axis of S at speed 3 fifths C, and it's moving in the positive x-axis direction. An event takes place in the prime frame at coordinates x prime is 6 meters and t prime is 8 times 10 to the minus 8 seconds. We suppose that the two origins of the two frames, x is equal to 0 or x prime equals 0, coincide at time t prime equals 0 and t equals 0. And we ask, what are the coordinates of this event in the frame s? The transformation equations are the Lorentz transformations. x is gamma x prime plus beta ct prime, and ct is gamma ct prime plus beta x. Notice that there's a plus sign right here, not a minus sign, because as the s prime frame is moving in the positive x direction, then to transform back into x and ct coordinates, the unprime coordinates, these need to be positive values. In other words, just waiting longer on the clock in the prime frame should make the x coordinate grow. We always have to look carefully at what the signs are on the beta term in the two transformation equations. In this case, beta is given to us. It's 3 fifths because we're told that v is equal to 3 fifths c. As a result, gamma, which is 1 over square root of 1 minus beta squared, works out to be 1 over square root of 1 minus 9 25 which is the same as 16 25 Therefore, gamma works out to be 5 fourths. It's helpful to cast t prime into c times t prime. That works out to be 24 meters. As a result, the coordinate x can be easily calculated. We plug in 5 fourths for gamma, we plug in the value for x prime, we plug in the value for c times t prime, and we remember that beta is 3 fifths. x therefore works out to be approximately 93 meters. ct, we plug again the expressions for the Lorentz transformation, plugging in for gamma, beta, ct prime, and x prime. This works out to be 75 meters. Or if we're asked for what is the time t, we divide by c, and this gives us 25 times 10 to the minus 8 seconds. And there we have it in short order. We've cast the coordinate x prime and t prime into the new coordinates x and t.